Hello, good morning. My name's Emma Sigaran for hauls and vlogs and chats and I'm back with a video that a few of you actually left in the comments. Are you gonna be doing a packing for Disneyland Paris video? And I say to thee, to you, yes I am, and that is this video. Welcome, we're gonna be packing for Disneyland Paris. I have got my um, Walt Disney World, I don't know how I'm gonna show you the back. <laughs> Walt Disney World spirit jersey from when we went to Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party in 2019. So I've got that on. I've also got some pumpkin earrings on. I am going to be, whilst I'm doing this, I'm going to be watching Practical Magic. You put the lime and the coconut. Um, my uh, girl is off school this week for her half term. She broke up a week early, so she may be popping in and out and had to help. So the plan is, these things, this takes me ages. <laughs> this takes me ages. And I'm not even going to pack the park bag in today's video or the um, the bags for the car because we're actually going in the car. I will do that in the next video uh, because I've got to go out and get some treats and snacks and stuff. So I will all show you that in the next video. This is just the cases. So I've bought down some of the kids bits and bobs that I've been collating upstairs. Also, this is not a kids bit. This is for me. Um... And these are mine as well. I've just been getting bits and bobs out. So how I like to pack is I like to pack in outfits. And we will also have a special bag probably for like fancy dress. Because we are taking quite a bit of fancy dress this time because we're going for Halloween. We are taking Iron Man. Um, we're taking Jack Skellington. We're taking Thanos. We're also doing a family fancy dress outfit whilst we're out there. So, uh, which I will not be showing you today, so I need to pack that. <clears throat> so I like to pack by outfits. So that is my plan today. Um, and there are there is a few days of half term before we go to Paris. We are at home for a few days. Before we go, we're gonna do, um, I'm gonna go to Warwick Castle. We're doing pumpkin um, carving and stuff. So I need to make sure I have some stuff that we can wear. So there might be a couple of outfits where the trousers have to be popped in next week. I've checked the weather. It is gonna be quite mild whilst we're there. It's gonna be between 14 and 19. And also, good news, it's gonna be raining every day. <laughs> There's one day it's not raining. It's fine. We've been to Disneyland Paris so many times where it has just rained the whole entire time we're there. It doesn't look cold, so I'm unsure if I'm gonna pack thermals. I'm not sure, I'm thinking about it. Let me know in the comments, because obviously we don't go for a bit. Let me know in the comments if you think I should pack thermals, but it does look like it's going to be quite warm. So it will be a lot of um, just trousers and a t-shirt, maybe with a hoodie on for the kids. And obviously in the video I did last time, I showed you some of the outfits that I will be taking. So, shall we get going? Because we are going in the car, we are going to be taking three cases. We will also probably take a big bag of snacks that we will eat for the week and we often just leave those in the car and then pop to the car park before we go to the parks. These are American tourist suitcases. We have had them a while. This one is missing a wheel. They do tend to miss wheels, um, which is a little bit annoying. They are great suitcases, really, really fun. I will say now they have got a bit more popular so when you do a Disney trip, everybody has the same suitcases, but this is gonna be in our car so it doesn't matter. I don't know what's in here. I've got packing cubes in one of these, so I'll show you those. I do like to pack things in packing cubes. For me, Erin um, and Ethan, not for Stephen, because he doesn't believe in the packing cube. The foolish man. So let me see which packing cubes we have got here. I won't be taking a snorkel. <laughs> I can tell you that much. That is gonna be removed. That must be from our last holiday. Gosh, that was a pain in the bum. I had to go in every case. So we have, uh, my girl usually has the pale blue ones but there seems to be of course there it look, feels like there's something missing here but i'm not sure where it's been because i've gone through all the cases so i don't know what's going on there and then my boy has the dark blue ones i wonder where those are i don't know because i've gone through every single case and the, mm, i've gone through every single case and then i have these and then this little makeup bag is the perfect shape to put in ears so we'll carry all our ears in there so shall we get going <laughs> i've also found that plugs there also seems to be some like 
plug is missing. I don't know what's happened. I don't know what has happened with our packing, but I am going to get the kids' stuff on here all nicely packed, show you the stuff that we will be taking, um, <clears throat> and then try and get things in these packing cubes. They are great. They're all from Amazon. I won't be putting a link because you can literally just Google packing cubes and it will come up with hundreds of different colours and combinations and I've had no problem with them. They're all great quality. They do sometimes say, oh, say funny things like, wish you have a beautiful life. <laughs> I've got some funny catchphrases on them. But yeah, no, these are fine. Right, let's go. Okay, here we go, guys. This is Ethan. So each day has got um, a top, some underwear, socks and bottoms. There are a couple of bottoms that I'm going to have to put in next week because he'll be wearing them um, before we go. So we've got like a uh, Marvel outfit because we're going to the Avengers part. We've not seen it before. We've got a Mickey, uh, a Disney sweatshirt. We've got a pumpkin Mickey t-shirt. We've all got one of those. We've got Mickey sticking his tongue out. We have got a spare t-shirt. Um, some swimming trunks and some spare underwear there. And we've got a really nice sweatshirt here, which also needs some trousers. And their pyjamas, they're going to have Nightmare Before Christmas pyjamas. They've both got the same pair. This is all up on. And then hats and stuff for Ethan, I am taking. And he's going to wear this one in the car when we're going down. And we've got this one, which is new from Asda, which looks really cute. Uh, his Yoda ears, which I don't know if he'll wear or not, but I like them. And of course, the goofy hat. And then, <laughs> we have all this fancy dress. And I think we're just going to have to take a big tote to shove all the fancy dress in. Because he's got a lot. I mean, this is ridiculously huge. So, let's see if we can get all of this into his little um, packing cubes. But he's done, so we have an outfit upstairs for them to travel in, and then they'll be there four nights, five days, so that's five outfits. And of course he'll be wearing this fancy dress most of the time, so it's more than enough. You always need to pack spare pants, so don't forget. Here we go, I just need to put an extra pair of trousers in. There's plenty of room in this. I've packed some waterproof bottoms just in case it gets very rainy. Um, the kiddos will be probably be wearing their coats in the car, I imagine, so I don't need to pack those. Um, Pyjamas, there is a bit of extra room, so I'm definitely going to put some more bits and bobs in there whilst we are there. In fact, I've got a big bag upstairs of stuff. Um, hmm, I'll bring that down in a bit. So yeah, my boys is done, so I'm going to put those in the case and I'll show you that. The good thing that we are travelling in the car, I don't, I usually have to split all the clothes up because I'm worried we're going to not have clothes. But we don't have to this time, so I can put them all in one side and there's plenty of room to put a pair of shoes down. Um, I, I think I am going to have to go out and buy some boots because I'm a little bit worried about their trainers getting wet. And they need boots for the, they need boots anyway, don't they? But my boys are size six now, what? So he's all done. Now on to the girl's clothes and haul her little ensemble and she's actually here today so she can help me choose what she wants to wear okay she has come through and agreed with these clothes so there will be no discussions when we get to Disneyland Paris we've got this villain's long sleeved long sweatshirt we have the same Mickey pumpkin t-shirt um, that my boy has got with some black trousers and some black socks we've got a very old um, Mustard Mickey t-shirt, which I've also got, and we've got wet with some blue jeans. And she will probably wear those jeans again with something else. So we've got a sweatshirt, Mickey sweatshirt here with some black flared trousers, the same pyjamas that um, Ethan's got. And also this outfit, which I love, which is like a um, Cruella de Vil Maleficent top with some purple jeans. And I've got uh, a bikini, because um, it's a simple... We have got, uh, oh, what is this word? Waterproof pants, which I don't think she'll want to wear. But I'm packing another sweatshirt because she does get a little bit cold. So that sweatshirt can just be chucked over something else because she can't, She even came in and said, oh, you know, I'm worried I'm going to get a bit nippy because she does feel the cold a bit more than the rest of us. So now it's time to get all these into the bag and then I shall tackle the arse. 
here we go. I've got it into two and a half bags with some room. Um, and she's going to be in charge of like packing her own earrings, toiletries and all that kind of stuff. Um, I've just packed these and as I said I went through them with her to make sure we weren't going to have any um, fallings out. <laughs> any refusers to wear. Right, I'm going to go upstairs and pack some of these. These are absolutely beautiful. These are just gorgeous. Um, what does it say? Haunt it. I don't know, that's a weird thing to say. <laughs> but I love them. So let's take you up to the ear. We have a lot of Halloween ears that I've been collecting over the years. So um, I'm going to pack all of these. I tend to get two. So me and my girl can match and uh, I need to cut off, look at these long labels. I need to cut off long labels and then I will pack all of these. These are the very first ears, Halloween ears we've got. They're so tight on your head though. They give you such a headache. The others, thankfully they've all got on a little bit, um, but I love these. So let's try and get these in this bag. Wish me luck. Okay, this just ain't happening. <laughs> I've got most pairs in. I'm going to have to use one of the small packing cubes to put the uh, other ones in. It is just just simply not working for me. So, um, it's, I think it's because they're quite poofy ones and they've got big bows on. So, we've got some of them in and I'll pack some of these others in a packing cube. Actually, we will probably want to keep a couple of pairs out, won't we? Because I've got Ethan's little baseball cap. Maybe me and Erin can wear these for like in the car. So we just need to pack these two. Whoo! Yeah, we'll keep those out um, for our little travel outfit. Yeah. So for the car driving down, they've both got a hoodie and also a t-shirt from Pep & Co, which says the Buku crew and some hats, they'll have like tracksuit bottoms and I don't know, whatever my girl will want to wear. She might want to wear some tracksuit bottoms or jeans, maybe leggings because we're going to be in the car quite a long time. So this is just like a car outfit. Now it's time to take my stuff down and also Stephen's stuff and work out exactly what I'm going to be wearing because I have a lot of choices I'm excited to say. Also, as a bit of a prequel to the next video, I'm going to be doing toiletries. These are all ready and waiting. And this has got all sorts of stuff in for the kids' car bags. And Erin um, and I will go and get some treats tomorrow. We, I'm going to go and get my nails done. And we're going to go and get Stephen some sh uh, birthday presents because he's actually, we're actually on holiday when it's his birthday. So that'll be the next video. And here is my, this is the bag of my bags. A bag of my bags. Let's take this down. I am not going to pack for myself in outfits. I am just packing loads of things. I've got a few um, Halloween dresses, which you would have seen in the last video. A few t-shirts. I'm packing a couple of jumpers. So I've got a spirit jersey and a Jack Skeleton jumper. I am taking some um, leather leggings and also a skirt. I've got socks, underwear, tights, a my pajamas. Um, and I'm going to take my Converse and my Docs. So I'm taking all of this stuff and I'm going to wear the spirit jersey I've got and now I'm going to wear it with some black leggings and probably my Converse, I think, for the journey there. So let's get all this in that. Da -da! Okay, I've got all my stuff in. Um... That's good, That's, that, that is so big. So yeah, I'm gonna wear the spirit jersey I've got on now with leggings and my Converse and I will pack my docks. So we've still got all of that massive case spare. Obviously we need to pack toiletries and Stephen's stuff. Um, but I think we're gonna be okay. I think we should be fine. My pumpkin bag will, I'm gonna put I need like a bigger bag over here because that can't be packed because it all, it'll get ruined. So I'll put that over there and that can, whoopsie, that can go um, with those stuff. Uh, and I think that's all I'm going to do for today. Uh, my bag in the car is going to be this Ursula one, I think, probably, because I can fit quite a lot of stuff in it. 
because it's we're on like a big old long car journey and hello she is fabulous so that is my plan for that and we've still got some of these left which we can put toiletries in and stuff so what i'm going to do is i'm actually going to shut all these now get steven to take them back upstairs and then i will do the rest of it towards the end of the week after i've been to the shops with erin so there we are that's most of the clothes packed I will be back with a video where we do a, a park bag and also snacks and toiletries and all that good stuff. Um, and I've been collecting little bits and bobs because we're going to be in the car for a long time. The kids are going to need to make sure that they've got some activities to do. So I've got to get all that done as well. But I need to get these out of the room. They're just, they're just taking all, all them. So I'm going to zip them all up stand them up and see if Stephen will take them upstairs or even just like shove them in the corner for a little bit so there we go thanks so much for coming along with me for my little pack with me as I said I'll be back in a few days with some more kind of like the nitty gritty bitties um I'm really really excited it's strange when you know it's going to be wet right no it must get boots must get boots must get boots must get boots I'm trying to think what boots I can get my boy I don't really want to take welly boots when they were little we would take welly boots I Actually, no, I think I think Ethan might wear welly boots. I'm not sure Erin would wear welly boots. I'll ask him later because maybe he will. I don't think she will. I think she'd be like, I'm absolutely not. And maybe I can get some like trendy, not hunter ones because they're really expensive, but like trender hunter style. We're going to go shopping tomorrow so we can have a look. Right, I love you lots and I'll see you in a few days. Goodbye.